Um, but yeah, I, I hear you on that. But here, here's the other part, though, guys. This is just in everything. Okay, you guys ready for Life 101? All right, check this out. You know what it costs you to tell the truth? Like, straight up. It costs you a lot. And that's what I'm asking for from, like, YouTubers and AMC and the board of directors. and everything. I just want the truth, right? So it costs you a lot. And I know it's going to cost you some money. It's going to cost you loyalty. You're going to lose a lot. But do you know what it costs you to tell a lie? Everything. It costs you everything. AMC leadership, Adam Aaron, these YouTubers, and anyone else, because you've lied this long, it costs you everything. That's the difference. I could either tell the truth and it cost me just enough, just what the true value is of me and my words. That's the truth. If my, if my truth is only worth, you know, X amount of views or... N no, I don't sell merch. I don't care. If that's what it's worth, like, right? Like, we only get this many people in the room and this is it. But you can lie and you can get millions? Nah. Keep your lie because I know you're going to lose it all. I woke up this morning and I saw Matt Kors' channel. Because somebody wrote in the chat, somebody said, man, Matt Kors is, is blaming AMC, calling him crazy. He's telling him that they don't know what they're talking about. He's distancing himself from the crew again. And I was just like, right, I want to go hear what he has to say. That man has 400,000 viewers, 400,000 subscribers across all platforms, 400 something. He had a thousand views. I was like, wow. I remember that dude had 70, 80,000 people at a time in his chat. He was cashing out, making millions, hundreds of thousands, as he calls it. I want you guys to know the business of telling lies. It might feel good in the moment, but it's going to catch up to you, and it's going to cost you everything. So just know that, Adam Aaron, that in the, and this is, happens in all life. This is all life. And let me tell you something. You ever been 20-something? Half of you guys in the chat are probably 20, 30-something. The rest of us that have been around for a while, 40-plus, I can say that now, 40-plus, we've all run this game. When you lie... You lose trust. Flat out. You might even admit to the lie, but you've lost that trust. So it's gone. You'll tell the truth and you'll still lose trust as well. But at least we know where you're coming from. But that happens like in all things, right? Like even in relationships. How many failed relationships do you have because you didn't tell the truth? You just lied. Maybe it was meant to fail. This is a relationship. This is something. You know, guys would go out there and be like, oh, I'm just here to make money. Like I heard, I literally heard Matthew Kors say today, this is the year we short everything and everyone, even your investments. Basically saying, let's be the villain. He's like, I don't care if I'm the shorter. We're here to make money. And I'm just like, whoa. Like they don't, they don't get where I'm coming from. I'm here to go to work. I'm here to go to work, make some more money, take that money, invest it and call it a day. And I'll see you in like 20 years when it's all said and done. 